What's up world? My name is Sarah and welcome back to another episode of whatever it is that we're doing here. I don't know why, maybe <sighs> she going to a new home. Hmm. One thing I've noticed, I'm not keeping it and I like the brand. I need all the help I can get. I don't want to get rid of all of them. If there is an item, another time. It's going to be a random haul of decluttering. This means war. <sighs> Here we go. I am who I am, you get the drift. Which I did. I don't even know my own, own intro. <laughs> Today we are tackling the decluttering of my closet yet again. And I know I said last year, the beginning of 2023, that I would be decluttering my home, which I did. But we are planning on moving at some point and that's a whole different series and because i am who i am i really need to get on my decluttering game and today that is exactly what we're doing so i'm gonna start off this year's decluttering video with a bunch of cardigans tops just i think there's one skirt anywho it's gonna be a random haul of decluttering and I am crossing my fingers that I can get rid of all of these in this video. But if there is an item that you think I should definitely keep, let me know in the comments because yeah, decluttering can be overwhelming and I need all the help I can get. First up is a gray cardigan, just a very simple, relaxed gray cardigan, has pockets, it fits really comfortably, and there's nothing wrong with it. I, I really like it, I enjoy it. Maybe the pockets are a tad bit small for my liking, which women are still struggling with. This is a fast fashion brand, nothing, too exciting but all in all just a great piece but i think we are going to give her to a new home now if you know i thrifted a bunch of granola style granola girl items and i got a bunch of fleece and i have thrifted some before and also donated this is again nothing wrong with this in great condition i love red my husband loves red on me but one thing i've noticed why i don't wear this is because the pockets that are otherwise great they don't have zippers and i think a top like this the pockets need zippers or at least that's why i haven't been wearing this individual for some reason so i am going to donate this i have no idea what this brand is but a red soft very comfortable really nice nothing wrong fleece layering piece but like i said for some reason i haven't been wearing it and i don't think it's because red i think i'm gonna have to do a thrift red because even though i got rid of a whole bunch of red last year something during i think maybe during the holiday season seeing people wearing red and wearing red myself it just sparked something so even though i am getting rid of a red fleece I think, I think, we should probably do a thrift red. What do you think? Now, if you saw my New Year's Eve vintage after ski video, you saw that I thrifted a black version to a similar top as this. This doesn't fit the same way. I don't think it's the same brand. It's not the same brand. This is this brand. I think this is from Lidl, like the grocery store. They also have, every once in a while, they'll have like clothing items. And I don't know if this is, I don't think this is the same brand as the black version of this, but this, for some reason, I don't know if it's the stitching that went wrong or something. It just doesn't fit comfortably. So maybe it's my body shape, I don't know. But this gray layering piece is going to a new home, even though I think, I, uh, yeah, I'm not keeping it. Here we go with more red, but I'm not wearing this. Not because I don't love Mickey, because I absolutely do love Mickey. And this crew neck is so nice. I'm thinking maybe my niece might like this. I'm not 100% sure. She might like it. I don't know. I'm gonna have to send a picture to ask if she likes it. Otherwise, this is going to the donation box and Mickey can find a new home. I mean, 
It's kind of fun. It would be hard to say no. More great cardigans. This is such a nice color. It's a dark burgundy red, but I haven't been wearing it. And I don't know, it hasn't been that long since I think I thrifted this, maybe. <sighs> oh my God, that's so good. <laughs> so a nice dark purple, dark burgundy, soft cardigan that uh, I, I don't know what the brand is, but we are going to donate this. It's nice and soft though. I, I really like the texture, but I have a whole bunch of this type of cardigan and I, I can't keep them all. So she go into a new home. This is a hard to let go because I love bat sleeve shirts. I don't know why. I think they're comfortable and they look good, but this is a black knit bat sleeve super cute H&M knit that we just, we have to make big cuts and this is making the declutter cut. So like I mentioned, it's, it's an H&M knit. I mean, one of my sister-in-law loves black, but I don't know if she's into the bat sleeve and especially because this has a bit of a shorter cut. Usually she likes to wear shirts that cover her areas. Another cardigan, it's a black one. This also has pockets and buttons as well. The pockets are quite small on this one too. This is the brand and it's a really nice knit all in all. But like I said, I have a whole bunch of this kind of cardigan because I really like this style, but some of them have to go and this one is one of them. Nothing wrong though, and I like the brand. Here is a men's crew neck, a gray one with a kind of vintage-y worn logo. Nothing wrong, great crew neck. I love a great crew neck, and the men's crew necks are, for some reason, a lot of times they're better than women's, so that's why I like to thrift in the men's section as well, because you never know what you're gonna find. Unfortunately, this guy did not make the decluttering cut to save. This is the brand. Nothing special again. I think this is nice on, but I haven't been wearing it, so it's got to go. A few more items. This is a very basic Forever 21 pencil skirt that's like a jersey fabric. Really nice, nothing wrong, super cute. And a sweater, I mean, nothing wrong. I haven't been using it, so it has to go. I mean, I'm not wearing that many skirts and dresses, but yeah, I don't wanna get rid of all of them. Yeah, when it gets warmer. I don't know, like I said, again, another series, another video, another time. Now, out of all of the pieces, this is going to be, I think, the hardest to say goodbye to, only because the color is so good on me. It's a, it's like an orangey peach knit and the knit itself isn't, there's nothing like, it's very basic. Super cute on, comfortable, I like it, but the color is what has been keeping me from not getting rid of it. This is the brand, I don't know if you can see it, but the color is just, I don't know. Like the knit itself, there's nothing too, it's not fancy, it's not too rugged. The color is just, I don't know. What do we do with this one? Help a girl out. I am so happy that we have kickstarted our 2024 decluttering because this means war. <laughs> I really need to be serious with this. So even though we are continuing on our thrifting adventures for sure, I also have to be super mindful of getting rid of things that I'm not wearing. So it's a balance. In with the new, out with the old, or I don't know if it's in with the new, if it's thrifted, but you get the drift. Now go ahead, like this video, and let me know what kind of decluttering I should do. If you have tips on how to declutter, and uh, yeah, I know the Marie, oh, I forgot her name. Anyway, the, the girl, the female that wrote the book about decluttering and if it brings joy or anywho, maybe I have to be more strict with uh, my decluttering journey. Anywho, Z, remember to subscribe to the channel so you can find me back for next week's video. Who knows what we'll get into. Toodaloo. <laughs> 
I don't even know my own, own intro. <laughs> Here we go. Oh. Mm -hmm.